Hey everyone, today we have this 2022 Ford Bronco Badlands done with a full RTR setup. This customized beauty is awesome. Let's check it out together. So in the cactus gray color, it looks amazing. You can see that the tires and rims have been upgraded to a 35 inch with a custom RTR rim. The fenders have been extended to accommodate. It does have the modular front bumper with the park sensors in it. If you get too close to some in the garage those will beep and let you know uh, has an upgraded rtr grill with the led lights in that signature rtr look those headlights are also fully automatic including auto high beam this does have the 360 camera upgrade which also goes in that nice grill giving you a great trail camera for going down the trail on the side you will see the rtr badging on the side there and then up top you see these five project x spotlights giving you all kinds of lights if you are doing some off-roading you also have the upgraded rtr deck link package on this that makes it look super sharp uh, it does have a little bit of a lift just a little over one inch in there to help clear out those tires and then you have these nice rtr rocker sliders work both as a running board and a platform to stand on if you want and to really protect the rockers on this uh, your mirrors do have that camera system underneath and full led lighting they have a blind spot system in them so that lights up when something's in your blind spot uh, and the mirrors do stay on when the doors come off which is cool all the doors and the roof come off it does have the modular roof um, to get in or out of this bronco you can put your code inside this is, has the keypad or you can put your hand inside the door handle it'll unlock with the heat of your hands press this button to lock it you can also use this key fob with unlock lock remote start uh, alarm or you can download the ford pass app and do that anywhere in the world for free thank you for tinted windows off the back look great again i love these graphics we open this up and you get your first look at this badlands interior nice little touches of orange inside here got molly strapping on the back seat there and then this is the leather surface um, really nice and easy to wipe down you've got your power window switches in the back and you also have inverted power supply and usb everything in the window uh, window switches in the middle because the doors do come off and this roof does come off as well as we come to the back here you have an upgraded modular bumper from rtr a nice recovery spots on there your led taillights in the back a fifth tire here with the rtr rim and rubber and then you have a nice gas can holder um, super cool you can open this up very easily you just pull this pin and this piece just tilts forward and that gas can comes out nice and easy um, let's go inside and check out some of the features inside this badlands so you can take a look at that so we're opening up the driver's door here. So you've got some more strapping here, your power locks and all your door control. Uh, nice handle to get up and in. You've got all your headlight, set it and forget it automatic headlights, interior dimmer switches, and these are the mirror lights to turn those on and off. Electronic park brake. Um, you've got on the bottom here drain plugs in the bottom on the floor if you get too much water down there and then your seats are manual adjusted but they are leather and I love the Bronco embossed in there. Let's climb up inside this. Okay now that we are inside this vehicle we're going to go ahead and hit the push button start. Um, our display is going to come up nicely. You can see you've got the all sorts of information on there including a digital speedometer and pitch and roll and off-road settings um, when we come onto our steering wheel we do have the upgraded cruise control with the adaptive cruise control so it'll slow you down with the vehicle in front of you also has a lane departure warning system some volume for the stereo with a nice bronco bronco emblem in the middle controls for that display up top as well as hands-free controls um, this is a leather wrapped steering wheel and it is heated feels like a warm cup of coffee first thing in the morning up on the dash you do have a nice Bang & Olsen stereo speaker. That's a center channel right there. You can see another one of those Bang & Olsen stereo speakers right there. Um, you've got a little spot here, and that is actually for a GoPro mount with a USB cable for charging it. Um, awesome. The Broncos are made for a million accessories. Got some switches here with the Badlands. You do have front sway bar disconnect, front and rear locking differentials, and trail turn, or as I like to call it, donut mode, as you can really pull some donuts and you pull that on. Uh, we've also got track control and four-way flashers 
huge 12 inch screen which looks amazing has a hard base navigation system in it and the new sync 4 sync 4 lets you wirelessly do apple carplay and android auto so this can become uh, your device all your uh, apps on there like your podcast your spotify all that kind of stuff can come up here wirelessly which is so nice uh, if you go into the features screen another nice one is the zone lighting so you can turn the whole outside of this vehicle into a great big flashlight if you'd like uh, we can hit all zones there and the whole outside of this vehicle is now lit up so nicely with all those led lights um, as we come down to the bottom, so you've got volume controls, your stereo, and then if you press this, this is your camera system. You can see all around us and in front of us, and if we hit this menu, we can go front camera. So if we're driving down the trail nice and slow, you can actually see that. As we come down here, we've got dual climate control, my side, my passenger side, our heated steering wheel and heated seats, fan controls, uh, and then this is a sealed USB and USB-C power supply. Um, Bronco Ford plate there. A nice Bronco on here and then your gear shift so you can go into a manual mode if you like and you can shift up and down just using this plus and minus cup holders in here and then we have our four-wheel drive controls so you have two high four high four automatic set it and forget it four low uh, and if you press this button this is really cool you hit this one and you'll see trail control what's that for that's for setting your cruise at like really low speeds if you want to uh, just creep down the trail and not have to worry about um, pressing the gas or the brake you can use trail control also has the goat mode dial so when we turn this over goat mode means go over any terrain as we turn this you'll see we can go from normal to eco to slippery to mud and ruts to sand and then to Baja, which is the most extreme. Old oh, rock crawl, sorry, that's the most extreme. And that goes into four low. So there are all those different uh, modes for going over different terrains, that kind of stuff. Um, you can just drive it around in normal or eco or sport if you like. But if you're really going off-road, and those terrain modes really help out a lot. We also have the mirror controls right here. Window controls. Uh, four automatic for all four windows, which is nice. And then a locking center console here, um, which you do have a 12-volt power supply up top electrochromatic auto doing mirror we've got some auxiliary switches uh, which we have the lights programmed on which is awesome and then you do have some map lights there garage door openers to finish it off and i love that the front part of this top can come off you just release these handles and you can just have kind of a t-top style if you don't want to take the whole top off inside you will see number 13 of the rtr package right there and you got Vaughn Gittin Jr. signature on that plaque um, from RTR so beautiful vehicle uh, thanks a lot for taking a look at this video with me do me a huge favor and click subscribe to this channel if you like videos like this hit that bell icon and uh, you'll be notified every time I make a video and if you really like this video give it a big thumbs up thanks everybody